one of these jars can run for six days uh, continuously, which is crazy. So uh, maybe I'll put it to the test. Hi everyone, and welcome back to my channel. Today, I'm gonna show you how to construct a very simple radiant heater out of terracotta pots, and also test the burn time of my DIY vegetable shortening candles. Now, lots of YouTube videos say that a six pound container can burn up to 72 days for eight hours a day, and that's a very long time. So today, we'll put that to the test. Also, if you didn't see my video of how to make the candles, I'll put a link in the description and you can go and watch that as well. Again, two of these jars fits into four of these mason containers, right? And two of these cans will burn up to eight hours a day for 72 days. So if you let that go continuously uh, 24 hours a day, that equates to 24 days. So this is 24 days continuously um, burning for 24 hours a day. Now we could calculate that down even further. If this is 24 days, that means each of these mason jar lasts about six days. So six times four is 24. So if you let this run 24 hours a day, one of these containers, one of these jars can run for six days uh, continuously, which is crazy. So uh, maybe I'll put it to the test and see if it actually lasts for seven days. Setup goes like this. You got the plate. You got the uh, candle, the uh, shortening candle, and uh, just some random rocks that can uh, hold up the uh, the pot. I broke up one of these um, uh, extra rocks we have outside, like a paver, yeah. and it goes over like that. Yep. And then I'll light it and I'll put it over. I'll set this up in my fireplace so we can see how long it actually lasts. Okay, and we'll set up the uh, test here at my uh, fireplace. Since it's so cold anyway, um, this, um, this is November right now, it's kind of cold. So maybe we can uh, benefit some from uh, some of that uh, radiant heat. Uh, I'm gonna put the plate here into the fireplace. These are just some random rocks, like I said, I, I found in the backyard. In there, and then we got the 10 inch pot. That should go over here. Okay, now that the light is lit, I'm gonna put the ter terracotta pot over. I can feel the heat coming from that small hole already. So if I cover this, I'm gonna make this radiant. Today is Tuesday, November 15th at 7 11. 7 11. Right, if it goes for six days, it should go to November 21st, um, 7 o'clock, November 21st. So let's see how long that burns. Today is Friday, November 18th at 1.21 p.m. Now, I didn't get a chance to follow up the last couple of days. Uh, I did kind of took a little peek underneath it a couple of times to see the light is still on haven't really moved anything else. So we're gonna check in at about half time right now. This is the third day, um, you know, supposed to go until 7, 7, 11 p.m. But I'm probably not gonna have time to film tonight. So I gotta do it right now. Oh, this is very warm. It was hot to the touch right here. Um, the plate. The plate, the outside is pretty warm, but over here, over here is super hot. Right here is hot. Now, let's take a look at the candle. Let's take a look at the, how much it's burned. Um, I would say right now it's 
about a third, maybe even less than a third. So, um, this is about almost three days. Another five, another six hours, that will be three days. All right, so I'm pretty sure this is gonna go six days. If not more, it looks like it may be able to go even more. So, um, yeah, the uh, 72 day burn, eight hours a day or 24 day burn, 24 hours every single hour and probably could be more. So I'm gonna put it back and then let it uh, continue. Hi again. So this is another three days after the uh, last follow-up. So um, a total of six days now. Today is Monday, the uh, November 21st. So it is still burning, guys, right here. All right. Okay, guys, so it is that time. Remember last time we checked, 7-Eleven. Monday, November 21st, six days ago, same time, uh, we check on this thing. So, um, let's take a look at what the uh, progress is as far as the candles getting burned or burning. Um, so this is very hot to the touch right here in the center, but overall, this is tolerable. Not that hot, but it's warm. Up here is hot. Um, Put this down really quick. There. Let's take this out. Ooh. What's this? Ooh, slow, slow, hot. Uh, let's see what else. Let's see how much we got left. Oh. So. I would say right now it looks like I say a fifth of the bottle left and uh, that's a that's a long time this is six days um, it's still got a fifth left maybe maybe even a couple of days but um, yeah this experiment it's gone well um, there's no smell at all, zero smell. Um, very clean. Let's take a look inside this terracotta pot. See, other than just a little bit of the uh, soot, other than that, it's really nothing. My initial plan was to have it in a greenhouse, in a small enclosed, maybe four by four, five by five greenhouse. Uh, one or two of these would work probably really well and also this is a bigger pot this is like a 10 incher um so i don't know if it's kind of if it radiates that much heat if it were closer to the heat source it would be a little bit better nevertheless it is warm um probably could keep a small small space warm um and have like two of these three of these burning at the same time that would really help and also, the rocks, I layered it really high. So maybe if we keep it lower, it can find something that like, or, or just not as high. This is about, i say about three, three and a half inch, maybe more, maybe even four inch rock. So if you find something smaller, so that uh, the heat doesn't escape, that'd be a little bit better. But anyhow, this is six days and I say I still have a couple of days left. I'm gonna have to use my fireplace pretty soon. Um, but other than that, um, I think these uh, vegetable shortenings burn really well, really long time. And uh, it's definitely worth the price. I built a couple of these uh, radiant heaters inside my uh, greenhouse. And that's gonna that's gonna keep all the plants inside warm and that's it for this video thanks for watching please remember to like and subscribe if you enjoy this kind of content it'll help out my channel a lot see you in the next video